Hello students, uh, today I am with a new topic and this topic is about propagation of error in uh, division means uh, when your result involves a quotient okay uh, in previous videos I already discussed about the uh, propagation of error in sum, propagation of error in difference and propagation of error in product so today I will explain you about the propagation of error in uh, when your result involves quotient okay means you are going to uh, find out the result for Z but for the measurement of Z you have to do A measurement and then B ka measurement karna theek hai z ka jo value aayega wo aayega jab aap a ka measurement karenge b ka measurement karenge fir a ko b se divide karenge okay so let us consider that i measure the quantity capital a and uh, delta a is the error in the measurement of a delta a is the uh, absolute error maximum absolute error in the a and uh, delta b be the absolute error in the measurement of quantity capital B. So definitely हमारे Z में भी absolute error आएगा और मैं उसे consider कर रहा हूँ delta Z. So I write expression for Z वो कुछ इस तरह का बनेगा Z plus minus delta Z is equal to A plus minus delta A divided by B plus minus delta. I have that type of expression here. After measuring capital A and capital B, थोड़ा सा मैं यहाँ पर mathematics करने की कोशिश करूँगा, so it is like मैं A को common लेता हूँ, अंदर बचेगा one plus minus delta A by A and denominator में आएगा B into one plus minus delta delta B upon B. I have this type of expression. और मैं अगले step में इसे ऊपर लेके आऊँगा, तो ये बनेगा A into one plus minus delta a by a and b inverse because I am taking b into the numerator so b inverse banega or yaha banega 1 plus minus delta b upon b also raised to power minus 1 so I have this type of expression or abhi mera ye LHS hai so after this I expand this using binomial expansion and wo kuch is tarah ka hoga a 1 plus minus delta a upon a ko mein aise hi lik tunga and b bhi yaha par b ki power minus hai i will take this b in the denominator to wo ke b ke saath aise likha jayega and i am going to expand this binomially binomial expansion means you have two terms and these terms may be in the form of sum or these terms may be in the form of difference or just like example of a plus b ka whole square okay jo uska result aata hai a square plus b square plus 2ab that is the binomial expansion there so yaha bhi hum binomial expansion ka use karenge i write the first term multiply the power with the first term but it will just come as 1 and first term mein aise likhunga and power se yaha multiply hoga minus plus delta b by b okay plus minus higher order terms ये जो higher order terms होंगी ये बहुत small होंगी आपके result पे कोई impact नहीं डालेंगी you can check this in your mathematics that कैसे binomial expansion करते हैं और जो higher terms आएगा उनका magnitude बहुत कम आएगा और उन्हें हम ignore करेंगे so we only left with this expression here मैं इसे फिर लिख रहा हूँ ये आएगा a upon b one plus minus delta a upon a multiplied with one plus minus आप इसे ऊपर नीचे लिख सकते हैं delta b upon you have this type of expression in the last अभी थोड़ी और derivation हमें इसकी करनी है और हम ultimately अपने result तक पहुंच जाएंगे so after doing all this we have this result there and we have left side में है z plus minus delta z and in right hand side we have a by b multiplied by one plus minus delta a by a into 1 plus minus delta b by b. We have this type of expression there. Now we divide both of these sides by z LHS ko bhi hum z se divide karenge aur RHS ko bhi karenge but z is equal to a b. So mein z ke jaga is side mein a by b likh raho because is taraf wala expression a aur b ki terms mein hai. So ye dono ek dusri ko cut karenge aur yaha ban jayega 1 plus minus delta z by z okay z is ke niche likha to ye 1 ban gaya 1 plus minus delta z by z is equal to ab hum isko bhi aapas mein multiply kar lete hain ye banega 1 plus minus delta b by b plus minus delta a by a plus minus 
delta a delta b divided by a b again this a delta a and delta b are the small terms product of small quantities is going to very small and sath mein iska divide bhi hai ab se so this result is very small so we again ignore that thing isse hum ignore karenge and at last uh, this one is going to cut with one so at last hamare paas jo expression ban raha hai delta z upon z is equal to plus minus delta a upon a plus minus delta b upon b so this plus minus delta z upon z is the uh, relative error in the measured uh, in z this is the relative error in z delta z upon z is the relative error kis mein hai ye relative error hai z mein or that is equal to delta a upon a plus minus delta b upon b so what can be the maximum value of relative error wo hum likhenge aur wo ho sakti hai aur wo hogi delta a upon a plus delta b upon b so jab bhi aap kuch aise expression is form ke expression ko jab aap solve kare you will get the result for a relative error and that relative error is just the sum of a relative error of individually measured quantities that's the result here okay aur aap yahan se absolute error bhi nikal sakte hai आप यहाँ z से मल्टीप्लाई जब कर देंगे तो यू कैन गेट द एब्सोल्यूट एरर इन z आल्सो सो डियर स्टूडेंट्स सो दिस इज द वे टू गेट द रिजल्ट फॉर रिलेटिव एरर और आल्सो फॉर एब्सोल्यूट एरर इफ यू वांट अ परसेंटेज एरर जस्ट मल्टीप्लाई दिस एक्सप्रेशन विद 100% यू विल आल्सो गेट द एक्सप्रेशन फॉर परसेंटेज एरर सो ये रिजल्ट हमें क्या इंडिकेट करता है कि जब हम सॉल्व करें एरर को uh, इस फॉर्म में क्वेश्चन वाली फॉर्म में जो हमारे रिजल्ट में क्वेश्चन इन्वॉल्व है और डिवाइड की फॉर्म है सो so, हमारा जो लास्ट में रिलेटिव एरर आएगा उस Z में वो बाकी मेजर्ड क्वांटिटीज का A अपॉन B का भी रिलेटिव एरर का प्लस आएगा एरर इज अगेन बींग वी आर एडिंग द एरर इन लास्ट हमने यही देखा कि एरर लास्ट में यहाँ पर भी ऐड हो रहा है सेम चीज जो प्रोडक्ट में हुआ था वो यहाँ पर हो रही है सो आई होप यू अंडरस्टूड द डेरिवेशन ऑफ दैट एरर प्रोपिगेशन थैंक यू वेरी मच